Hey there. As my brother-in-law put it, I have been busier than a long-tailed cat in a room full of rocking chairs. I recently was looking at a book that um, got me all excited about printmaking with found objects again. Something I did when I was younger but haven't had time to do lately. So I raided my local under a dollar store and I got all kinds of things to use for printmaking. Of course, the one thing I should have bought more of was ink, because my ink pad is a little lame. So I'll just go through the box here. Double-sided tape. I can't remember where I got that, but it's good for making cards. This stuff is, um, I think it's like wallpaper border material. It's like contact paper. It's sticky on the back side. I got two of them. You can actually cut this out and make stickers. Or use it as, you know, borders on your cards or whatever. Safety pins. All these uh, little objects you can glue to printing blocks. And then these little babies. Peace signs on erasers. You can use your eraser carving tools and actually follow the design. You could either cut out, like look at that one on the top corner. You could cut out all the blue and make a stamp. Or you could cut out all the green and make a stamp. And if you don't like peace signs, you can draw whatever you want on there and carve it out. Hearts. These little erasers are great for, um, you can either use them as a mounting block, which I have one here I did that way with, if I can find it, or, here it is, ah, landslide. Um, I wrapped old hair ties around it that wouldn't stay in my hair anymore, and then you uh, use that as a printing block. So you can also glue things to those, or carve them out and make rubber stands. This one has the rubber band around it. This. Trash, you would think. It's from the erasers. Perfect template to trace around a frame on a card, for example. Placemats. These are like plasticky, kind of icky for regular placemats, but you can use them as stencils and paint through the holes. Make a lace pattern or spray paint them. Cool. Double stick tape or foam tape giving your cards some if I can get that straightened out I can print with that this was a uh, trash but it's a good circle template and there were two of them with the mounting tape so save those for templates and, uh, I was thinking also keys I can um, glue those onto a wooden block and use those for printing well got dark outside and I skipped a couple things so here's some more stuff um, pumice stone I think I can print with that we'll, we'll find out um, strange looking this is a headband which I cut the elastic off but I think I can print that and make some pretty cool circles ovals and uh, this was a little um, ring that a scarf had on it that's part of the packaging, and I can use that either for a template with two different sizes, inner and outer diameter, or I might be able to print with it. And this is a clothespin, but see I put ink on it to try out some printing. And then this is the top of a lipstick tube, and I can use that to print squares with, or as a template to draw around, or to spray paint around. And I bought new eyeshadow, and of course I want to use that because it's new, but I have this old grungy one that I can use in my inspiration kit. And you can use this like chalk pastel to shade uh, images with, or make blush on cheeks or whatever. And if you don't wear makeup, ask your girlfriend or your mother, or a lady friend, or a gay friend if they have some. And uh, paper clips, pretty cool. Also glue those to a printing block and print with those. Or use them to keep all your papers together. That's my pirate flag. So there you go, a whole bunch of found objects. And I'm sure if you go through your house, you can find a lot more. And uh, also, you can use a regular pencil with an eraser, and you can carve like an alphabet or little designs on the eraser um, of the pencil. Oh, and I got the bin at the discount store, too, to put all the stuff in. You can also take all kinds of textures of string and yarn and cord and braid and trim and glue that to wooden blocks as well and use those to print with.
All right, I think I'm officially done for now, and I can't wait to print up some new fancy things. Thanks for following my YouTube stream, by the way. Bye, everyone. I only knew you as a name on my computer screen. You live 3,000 miles away by the Atlantic green. I lived in California along the Golden Coast. But you haunted my computer Like a ghost We talked about our kids, our jobs, yeah And all about our lives Talked of old romances and even Ex-husbands, ex-wives For months kept each other up late and Kept each other sane But the connection between us we could never explain Oh, I live by the Pacific And I'm feeling blue Yeah, Pacific blue We type for hours on end Till our fingers were sore Stared at our computer screens till We could stare no more then one day you sent me a ring that you had found With emeralds and diamonds circling all around 